Brain Tech here, where tech is made simple. So the site panel in the Google Chrome web browser on desktop, as many of you may know who do use Chrome, currently in the stable version, lets you access your reading list and your bookmarks. And as posted previously in Chrome Canary, which is a preview version, we also could be getting the option to add your journeys and also a feed, which currently is a dead feature in the site panel. But nonetheless, these options could be on the way. And also, as posted previously in Chrome Canary, there's also an option to resize the site panel to your own personal choice and preference. Now, I have come to find out over the last couple of months that uh, the site panel is something that users either like or they don't like. And for those of you who don't like the site panel due to the fact that some consider it to be bloatware and an, and an unnecessary feature, I may have good news as... Um, Google could be bringing an option to customize the Chrome site panel uh, in the browser. And that's because um, in a recent update to the Chrome Canary browser, the preview version, um, they have made a flag available, um, which at this stage um, isn't working, but nonetheless does give us a good indication um, that they could be rolling out options to customize the site panel in the a desktop browser. Now to enable the flag, um, as always, we just head to the address bar of the Omnibox and we enter chrome colon forward slash forward slash flags. And in this search, um, just enter and type in this flag, customize chrome site panel. And the description says, enables the ability to use customized chrome functionality from the unif unified site panel on the new tab page. And then obviously we change the default setting to enabled and we relaunch Chrome Canary to apply that flag. But now, as I mentioned, the feature isn't working. But if we go back to the site panel, over and above your reading list, bookmarks, journeys feed, we now get an option, customize Chrome. But when we click on that, um, it just says testing empty page for customized Chrome site panel web UI. So at this stage, although it is a dead feature, so to speak, um, it does give an indication that um, Google could be rolling this out uh, in the future and start testing this feature uh, in the preview versions and the Chrome Canary version of the browser. And at this stage, um, we don't know any more information other than what has been provided in the flag. So it looks like it, at the, at currently um, it's going to be a feature where on the new tab page in the site panel, uh, you, you will we either be able to customize features of the site panel. So for instance, you might be able to turn off the site panel or maybe uh, disable or turn off the reading list, bookmarks, journeys, feed, just different options um, regarding the site panel. So that may be good news um, for those of you who don't like the site panel. Or it may mean that, they, as they say, uh, uh, testing empty page for customized Chrome site panel web you are, or it may be an interface where you will be able to customize the new tab page directly from the site panel. But at this stage, it's anyone's guess. But according to the name of that flag, customize Chrome, Chrome site panel, this could be good news for those of you who do not like the site panel, where you'll have options now to maybe turn off and customize that site panel in the browser. But I will keep you posted as to any um, more information that comes to light, and then I will just upload accordingly. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.